reasonably mild weather today thanks to sunshine this afternoon. Temperatures climbed well into the 50s. Our official high 58, just two degrees off of our record high of 60 set back in 2017. We started off this morning at 34. By tomorrow morning, temperatures will be a tad colder than that in many places with slightly drier air moving in from Canada temporarily. Those temperatures now for most of us in the mid 30s. We're 36 degrees in Lima. It's 35 in Ottawa, down to 34 as we look back to the west in Van Wert and on the satellite and radar composite, partly cloudy conditions, but despite some extra clouds, no precipitation locally, and it will stay dry for the rest of tonight and during the daylight hours of tomorrow. That will likely change tomorrow night. Now that cold front went through today. It gave us some extra clouds and spotty sprinkles this morning. The front is putting the brakes on just to our southeast. At the same time, a storm system is forming along this boundary that's going to lift to the northeast over the next 24 to 36 hours. That storm system will intensify, so wind speeds will increase, and the storm itself will spread precipitation our way tomorrow night and that precipitation will fall in liquid form with a continuation of above average temperatures even though that cold front went on through a few hours ago. Skycast looks like this for the rest of tonight. Partly cloudy but still precipitation free. Clouds and some peaks of sunshine during the day tomorrow. Not a bad looking weather Wednesday with above average temperatures although not quite as mild as today. Tomorrow night the clouds thicken early on. By 10, 11 o'clock that rain shield advances in from the south and by midnight it's going to be raining all across our local area. Late tomorrow Tomorrow night, some areas of heavier downpours, as shown by the yellows and oranges on the map. The heaviest of the rain will depart by later Thursday morning. At the same time, those wind speeds really increase. Thursday afternoon, mostly cloudy, some spotty sprinkles, still rather windy. The wind will subside by Thursday night and especially Friday. Not much in terms of additional precipitation by then. But tracking those wind speeds, not much of a factor late tonight or during the daylight hours of tomorrow. During the evening, wind speeds increase. Here's 10 p.m. tomorrow, wind gusts to 17 miles miles per hour in Lima. As we move ahead into the daylight hours of Thursday, this is where those wind speeds really increase. 50 mile per hour gusts likely. So again, secure those loose objects outdoors tomorrow because Thursday it's going to be windy all across the local area. That wind speed will diminish later Thursday night and Friday morning. Just a bit of a breeze by then. Those temperatures now in the 30s. By daybreak, lower 30s should do it for most of us. 32 degrees Deschler, 31 Van Wert. Tomorrow afternoon with that partial sun, we climb back into the mid 40s. So not quite as mild is today's weather, but still above average in terms of our temperature. Rest of tonight, partly cloudy, colder are low at the freezing mark. Clouds and sunshine mixed tomorrow, 46 for the high. Seven-day forecast, rain tomorrow night. It turns very windy into Thursday. The rain shuts off midday Thursday. Temperatures cool from a high of 60 through the 50s and 40s in the afternoon. 43, mostly cloudy Friday. Chilly briefly for Saturday. We're back into sunshine on Sunday. Mild all over again, Monday and Tuesday of next week. Stuart and Katie.